Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum, my dear students. How are you? I hope you're enjoying the best of health. I welcome you in my class. That is English for Grade Two. We are learning Unit Four. Its title is the Running Machine. Today's lecture five, under the title of Pronunciation Skills, we will learn about irregular sight words, and we'll cover page number thirty and thirty-one of your book. In your previous class, English for Grade 1, I have taught you about irregular sight words. I hope you remember. If not, you may watch this video again. So today we learn further and we'll cover the SLO to identify and pronounce common familiar two or three syllable words and common irregular sight words. This will be our focus for today. So let's start with the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah says in Surah Ar-Rahman, verse 1 till 4, the most compassionate taught the Quran, created humanity, and taught them speech. Yes, my dear children, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is mentioning that Allah is the most compassionate because he taught us Quran and he created humanity and he taught us to speak. I wonder, Allah has taught us everything, whatever, even what we think, the way we see everything Allah has taught us. But look at this verse, Allah has specially mentioned speech. It shows the importance of speech. That's why whenever we, we speak, we should be very careful because Allah is mentioning, Allah taught us the speech, so we should speak properly. That is what we are learning. And today we will learn about irregular sight words. What ir irregular, uh, irregular sight words are that cannot be decoded and don't follow traditional English spelling rules. Whenever we want to read or write a word, we spell it and then we read it and write it. But there are few words for which this formula does not work. Why? Because they don't follow the traditional rules of spellings. They are little out of pattern. That's why we call them irregular. And to read them properly, we need to practice and learn them. Okay? So, irregular sight words are a part of sight words. Basically, we divide sight words in two categories. One is high frequency word and the other is irregular sight word. High frequency words are those words which we often read in our content and because we read it again and again, that's why we, whenever these words pop up in front of us, we need not to spell it, we just say it. But if we want to break it through regular spelling pattern we can for example the a uh, to that but it comes so often that we uh, quickly recognize and we say it but for irregular sight word though they can also come uh, very regular but because of their pattern they are irregular the word is could now we cannot read it through spellings okay the word is should this is also a word which cannot be break down for spellings. That's why we call them irregular sight word. Are you clear with the concept? So let's see what does your book say about it. Open your book on page number 30. Under the title of pronunciation skill, irregular sight words, read and say the following sight words. So, there are words given in your book, few are on page 30, few are on page 31. We'll apply sight reading strategies and what those are, see and say. And we'll learn these new words, inshallah. So, let, first we are going to read from page number 30. And what these words are? One, night, school, could, through. And next, page number 31, thank because home went just so these 10 words are there for you to practice so let's practice again one night school could through thank 
because whom went just again little faster one night school could through thank because whom went just so my dear fellow teachers this is the way how we can teach irregular sight words to our students this is the vocabulary given in book you may take more words for practice and kindly display them on the sideboard um, I mean if you have a uh, softball make a corner for sight reading and place these words over there when your students are done you may replace them with new Along with this video lecture, lesson plan, PowerPoint presentation, worksheets are attached. You may download it, print it, follow it as it is, or modify it for your convenience, right? So you, now you may pause the video and practice with your students at least for these words which are given in the book. Yes, my dear children, are you done with it? Good job. So these were the sight words for practice for today now it's time for your homework what you are supposed to do identify irregular sight words from your lesson so now you will find out irregular sight words means the words which are there in your lesson and they don't follow the regular spelling pattern you will find them you will list them and you will write them in your notebook this is your homework and it's time for practicing worksheet again my dear fellow teachers along with this video lecture this worksheet lesson plan powerpoint presentations are given in description box you may click the link download it print it and kindly give a printed worksheet to my students and children what you are supposed to do here is a list of irregular sight words which are given in this puzzle you have to find it circle it color it and say it for example the first word is give so where it is it's here give you will circle it then you will fill it with color and say it okay this is the way you will practice a regular sight word so in this way what we have learned today we learned the concept of irregular sight words and we pronounced irregular sight words and we planned to continue the practice of finding irregular sight words. So in this way, Alhamdulillah, we achieved our today's SLO that was to identify and pronounce common familiar two or three syllable words and common irregular sight words. This was our, our focus for today. Are we done with it? Yes. So that's it for today. Tomorrow I'll come again with a very interesting lesson. Till the time, keep practicing. Take very good care of yourself. Thank you and Allah Hafiz.